good morning one and all. It's a beautiful day today, isn't it? It is a beautiful day, it's very chilly. Um, so this week is repay week. Um, we're on our way now up to the farm so that I can do a bit of work with Mikey. Um, as you know, Mikey's been helping me in the tea room ever since we opened, two days a week, um, without any pay. Although I do feed him very well and he gets lots of cake. Um, but um, it's my chance to repay him now for all of his work to uh, go up there and help him learn how to mortar a wall. Now you all saw him come down and uh, did a little bit with me when we was doing a palm and one. And, uh, but that was quite a while ago and he's forgotten. So he now needs to learn how to actually mix the mortar. And um, we need to work on part of his camp house that they're going to turn into a big game room. So let's go and uh, have a couple of days up at the farm, but doing something a bit different this time. And uh, while I'm doing that, what are you doing, baby? I'm making tables. Uh, somebody wants four um, two-seater tables uh, for the cafe, and that is um, that can be used, uh, put together for four or six-seater tables. So we're doing that. So it's sourcing the wood, putting that all together, and hopefully putting, you know, getting most of that done today, because I shall be on my own. Woohoo! Because the tea room is obviously going to become a Christmas dining area very, very soon because Christmas is coming! Um, woo -hoo -hoo. And, um, and yeah, what we don't want to do is waste a four-seater ta four table on just two people sitting at it. So, um, and we've got nice quite thing is, is, Nice thing is, is that, that, you know, because we've had all these sittings, you've learned so much yeah. in these few weeks that we've been doing it that you suddenly realise, right, that's what I want, that's what I want. Because I do get a lot of twos, and obviously two at a four seat table, that's put the kibosh on having a four seat. If you get a walk in or whatever, four people, or even two people, it gets really difficult. So, hence the four two seat tables. So that's what we're doing this week. It's yep. um, Christmas planning week and working at the farm. So this <laughs> is the attic space of the camp house. So down below is where the campers, because um, obviously Limassan Farm Holidays has got the yurts and safari tents. So down below is where the bathrooms are and the kitchens that the campers are allowed to use. Up here is the attic space. This is the wall that we're working on today. We've already raked it all out, prepared it all, so it's all ready to start mortaring. Um, we did a little bit over here the other day just to look at what colour the the lime was um, that Mike has got because he's got a different sort of lime and sand to what we have been using. Um, it's a softer lime, but yeah. So this space is going to be a lovely um, sort of play area for the children, and um, it's going to be a games room, and it's going to have a little cinema in it. So all of these walls have got to be mortared, but we're going to work on the. Uh, not that one, but the one through there today, and um, get Mikey working on it so he gets used to mixing the cement and um, or the lime mix, and uh, yeah, just get him going really, and then hopefully he can continue, and I'll come up and help whenever I can. So let's get going. Let's go mix. You just have to be careful not to get the bucket caught on those edges, otherwise it will rip it out your hands. So have you... a shot of me as my <laughs> arms rip from my sockets. <laughs> so at least we'll have documentary evidence for the insurance claim. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Cool. Now the um, no. Now you put the um, lime in. Lime in. It is. Like just make sure you don't inhale if it dusts up. Okay. Get it in as quick as you can, and then uh, stand back if it brush if it. Um... Maybe cool. We make, maybe we should make our Christmas puddings in this, Lisa. That'd be a good idea. I made some um, steak and mushroom pies last night out of the beef bourguignon that was left. Yum, yum, right. And the last, last one of sand. sand yeah. Oh, 
Okay. Okay. It's Looking like good. Them pastries. <laughs> So now we need a bit of water, don't we? Yeah, so now it's mixing. Should get what? Shall I? Yeah, and let it mix. So I'm going to let you tell me when you think it's ready. Okay. Little balls, haven't we? Yeah. It's not really sort of flopping yet, is no, it? No, no, it's not flopping yet, so. So you can see from this side. Yeah. Oh yeah. Can you see it it's slapping? To slapping and stick to the side of the machine. Oh yeah, that's a good side to look. Yeah. So look, that you can really see that now flopping. So. Okay, turn the water off. So what do you do to check it? So I can turn it off. That's the red one. And um, stick your hand in. Yep. And grab a handful and just see if it holds together, which it is doing, isn't it? It is. So, would we. And it's still a bit crumbly, but would you work with that? Let me have a quick look. Yeah, I'd. Um, it's still. Yeah, so yeah. You think a little bit more? A little more bit more. Warped? Little tiny bit more. So it just holds. Yeah. Let's shape a bit more. Right. Oh yeah. Um, you can hear the look, thump. Where well, it's really flopping now from the top to the bottom. So I think that's perfect. Really? We're ready to rock and roll. We've got some spare stones to uh, put in the holes and um, yeah, off we go. Okay, so, so, Mikey, yes, how's it been? It's been fabulous. Just start doing our final bit of um, crushing back, well, bashing the mortar into the wall with this stiff bristle brush, which helps compact it. This is all I've been taught by Lisa, I don't know any of this myself, <laughs> and um, also gets the loose. Um, line off the face of the stones so it's already helping me see the outlines of the stones so when I come tomorrow to brush back the joints I can already see you know where I'll be doing my brushing back to clean up the face of the stone and we've had a great day it's been really fantastic so you pleased with the amount you got done today oh, no, I'm very pleased thank you so much for coming to help me that's okay. It's amazing. That's the least I could do with you helping out in the tea room. Oh, well, no, I'm loving it. I'm loving it. It's all about community collaboration. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh. Cool. Brilliant. I think we've done a brilliant job. I think we're done, aren't we? Yep. So you have to come back and film it when I've brushed Finish it. Finished it. Yeah, so I can uh, hopefully mix up my own lime mortar and even do a bit unsupervised. <laughs> Oops. Come and check afterwards. <laughs> check my working. I will. <laughs> what do you think? How's it? 
Looking. Looking good. Yeah, this is looking all right. Look. You pleased with it? Yeah, yeah. I mean, I'm loving doing this. It's, really, it's very satisfying work. It is, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> oh, it's looking great. Yeah, I think it's going to look. Lovely, so lovely when it's done, and um, it's just so nice to be, um, you know, preserving a bit of built heritage, isn't it? Yeah. So, Mr. Mikey. Yeah. End of the day. Oh, how do you feel? So exhilarated. It's really satisfying. Are you pleased with you all? Loads today, and uh, yeah, it's just really coming on. You can really start to see now how it might look um, when it's all finished. And you're confident with doing your mix? Sorry. Confident with doing oh, your mix? Yeah, yeah. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm definitely starting to be able to judge the flop. <laughs> the most important part. So, You're being able yeah, to recognise small balls, big balls and small flops. Balls, big balls and the flops. <laughs> That's what you need. Cool. Yeah, no, it's great. No, it's, it's been a really, really good day. Thank you. After one more day of working on his own, Mikey finally finished the whole wall. Just seven more to go. We'll come back and see Mikey when he's finished. We would like to say a huge thank you to all of our supporters, from our patrons to our GoFundMe donors, the people that are buying us a coffee on Go Buy Me A Coffee, and you, our subscribers, each week watching the adverts for us to give us a little bit of income each month. Even if it just adds up to a bag of sand, it all helps.
Someone to share my dreams Someone